Howdy. Today, here, I will tell you how to create an amazing really stunning old paper cutout logo PSD mockup in Adobe Photoshop to display your brand or logo designs in a unique style. You can mock up your logo design using this method and wow your clients. Business owners, advertisers, and marketers can use this process to create great presentations of their product brand. Check out the styles of different logos, how these logos looks amazing and professional. When you have designed your logo in Adobe Illustrator or any other vector logo design tool in a flat style, just follow the process which you will see in this video just ahead, you can create as many logo mockups in this great style as you want in just within minutes. So let's start. First, you need to have the PSD mockup file which you can get from this link, this link to file is also given in the description of this video. When downloaded, open the PSD file in the zip package in Adobe Photoshop. The PSD mockup is in high quality and you can notice the details of the cutout old paper logo and the wooden background that appears within the cutout area making the mockup a realistic paper cutout. In the layers panel, you can see a layer with label, your logo here. Double click the layer and it opens a tab window in Photoshop. In the tab window, you will see two layers, in which the second layer labeling background, is the vector masked layer. The first layer is the existing logo layer. Now, what you need to do is, just move to Adobe Illustrator where you have designed your logo. I have chosen some logo which we will be using the process to see how different logo designs look in this style. Select the logo, press Ctrl plus C or Command and C in Mac to copy the logo, switch to Photoshop. Now, a tricky and one of the most important part, click on the mask of the background layer and fill the color to white by edit, fill. You can see the existing Creative Alley's logo vanished from the old paper. Now paste the logo we have copied from Adobe Illustrator using Edit, Paste, Select Shape Layer and hit OK. Scale the logo and adjust the position. Now, another important step, press and hold Ctrl, Command, in Mac, and click on the logo thumbnail in the layers panel. The logo has been selected, now click on the vector mask of the background layer and fill it with black color using edit, fill. Hide the logo layer and press Ctrl plus D to deselect the logo. Cutout of the new logo has been created. Save the work file, save, and close the tab window. The great results await you in the next moment. A realistic and stunning old paper cutout logo mockup has been created for you. Following same the process, we will see how other logos look in this style. Stay with us.
Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed this tutorial which I'm sure you did, so don't forget to subscribe this channel. Act now and subscribe. Click the Creative Alley's logo at the right bottom of the video to subscribe and get more great information, tips, and tricks of Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Illustrator and other design tools. Also visit our website www.creativealleys.com for free graphic design resources including vectors, PSD mockups, web templates, fonts, icons, and more. Here are some more nice videos for you. If you still not subscribed, you'll really miss some amazing stuffs, hit the subscribe button now.